welcome back on my channel today's video is all about this makeup look actually is for halloween for me because today is halloween and uh, if you are interested how i created this makeup look then please keep on watching and also if you are new here Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that little ring bell button so this way you can be notified every time when I'm posting a new video. And also don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Facebook as well because I'm posting there every day uh, in my stories and you can get to know me better there. So yeah, let's get into the video. First of all, I'm going to put up my hair. I'm going to prep my lips. I'm using this Vaseline. This is the cocoa butter. I'm buying this in Morrison. I'm using this Elemis face toner. This is new. I ordered this a few days ago. And this is Apricot calming facial toner actually i'm using this three days ago my fiance said you smells like old people <laughs> i don't know for me it's nice apricot i'm going to use this primerizer from smashbox this is really good under makeup but I was talking about this um, in my previous videos, so you can check it out. And it's really good under makeup because it's not creasing or anything like that. So yeah, I love it. I'm going to put on my foundation. This is from Revlon 24 hour. Um, foundation and this is in color fresh beige this is new as well so i'm going to try out now i'm using my beauty blender sorry this is dirty because i used it today already this is not a matte uh, foundation this is like more glowing I'm going to put some on my neck as well. Now I'm done with the with the foundation. I'm going to put the concealer on, uh, which is from L'Oreal. These are new products as well. And this is in color golden beige and ivory. Ivory, yeah. So 1M and 3D read. Anyway, you can understand guys. I'm pretty sure. So I'm gonna mix these two colors. I don't wanna put a lot because I don't want creasing under my eyes. Because it used to crease a lot. This is from Zoewa. This is the 142 brush. It helps a lot under eye. Um, definitely. If you know anything guys which is good for these circles then um, let me know down in the comment area I would love to know <laughs> now I will apply a tiny bit of concealer on my eyelid as well so this way I can prep my eyelid for um, a shadow By the way, it's really good this foundation. I find it 
lightweight very lightweight you can't feel anything you can feel is it's an extra skin on your uh, on your skin on your face so it's really good i'm happy with it okay i think i'm done with the foundation and the concealer and now i'm going to set everything with um Fenty Beauty setting powder and this is the banana one so I'm using this brush from Zoeva and this is the 111 face finish this is perfect for um, setting powder this is the different I don't know if you can um, see on camera it's taking away the oil or the oil on my face can you see it so this side is glowy and this side is matte under eye I used to put everywhere around my nose t-zone and here is really getting oily all the time and on my whole face I like matte my skin is combination somewhere really oily somewhere it's just really dry okay let me drink my coffee mm. by the way here is 9 30 in the evening and yes i'm drinking coffee because i need to be awake because my little son has fever he got cold flu and he's really sick so i just want to be awake and um checking on him all the time okay the next thing eyebrows today i'm using this benefit eyebrow gale and this is number four looks like this so this is the little brush and I'm going to use like this and I'm just going to take a little bit and when I'm done I'm using this Anastasia brow pencil and now I'm not using the color I'm using the brush brush it through For eyeshadow, I'm going to use the nudes from Maybelline. These colors are so, so beautiful. And I'm taking this brush from Sigma. This is the E35. First, I'm going to use this color. And the other half, I'm going to use this color here with this brush from Sigma and this is the E40 double blending and I just put right here and I start to work out with circular motions. So I'm just blending together. Now I'm taking uh, this brush. This is from Sigma and this is E30 um, pencil brush. I'm going to use the same color, this one with this um, short short shader brush from Sigma. This is E E20. Now I'm going to contour and highlight and I'm going to use this palette from NYX. 
for contouring i'm going to use um, this color here I'm using my same brush no name no name no face no number <laughs> i'm going to use this Now I'm going to highlight I'll make them matching. So I'm going to use this MAC red lipstick. Imagine guys, I never wore um, red lipstick. So um, this is the very first time and I'm kind of excited. <laughs> Ooh. I mean, look at that color. Wow. This is the final look, guys. I had to use my lip brush from Sigma. This is L05. It's much easier to apply lipstick with lip brush. So you just take it and put it on like that. This lipstick is really good. I'm surprised. It's matte, but it's not that that kind of um, dried matte. You know what I mean? It's not like so dry on your mouth. It's, I don't know. And it's not sticky, which is really good. It's so, I don't know, so soft. And for last but not least, I'm going to put some um, Murphy setting spray. I like it a lot, especially when I'm filming and it's so hot in the room. <laughs> I can't open the window because otherwise you can hear every single little noise. So um, this is really good, like refreshing and cooling. Thank you so much for watching, guys. So this is the final look. I hope you enjoyed this video and you find it helpful and if you did please don't forget to give a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you didn't subscribe yet and you guys let me know in the comment section if you liked this video and if you like this makeup look and of course you can give me any ideas um i'm more than happy to to film it for you guys if you're interested in skincare or um any kind of um, makeup looks and i'm more than happy to to film it for you so yeah see you in my next video bye